Today we will discuss the factors affecting the gold price this week and provide an important gold price forecast for the days ahead. Hi, and welcome to Minuteman Precious Metals, where it's my goal to enhance your financial preparation and prosperity and motivate you by tracking my personal stacking adventure. Thanks to all my new and returning viewers. Please like and subscribe if you enjoy today's content and ring that bell if you'd like to be alerted when new videos are available. I appreciate your views, but I really need your likes and subscriptions to grow this channel. Thank you for your support. Gold prices ended this week on a high note, driven by China's robust stimulus measures and favorable U.S. inflation report. Gold marked its second consecutive weekly gain, highlighting increased investor confidence. The announcement of historic steps by China to stabilize its property sector, along with renewed hope for U.S. interest rate cuts, played a significant role in this bullish trend. A new Chinese stimulus boosted market confidence. China, a key consumer of gold and industrial metals, unveiled substantial measures to address its struggling property market. The Chinese government introduced a package that included 1 trillion won, or 138 billion U.S. dollars in funding, and eased mortgage rules. Local governments were also instructed to buy apartments, aiming to prop up the sector which had significantly impacted China's economy. These initi initiatives were welcomed by the markets, leading to a surge in gold prices. The CSI 300 Real Estate Index jumped 9.1% following the announcement. Analysts viewed these measures as a strong signal of government intervention to support the property market, a major driver of economic activity in China. A record high gold price in London is an extremely favorable sign. The London Bullion Market Association reported a record high for gold, with prices closing at $2,402.60 per troy ounce Friday. This milestone reflects the increased demand for gold as a safe haven asset amidst global economic uncertainties. The market's response indicates strong investor sentiment towards gold driven by expectations of continued support for central banks and favorable economic policies. The Federal Reserve is affecting two factors for the gold market. The first is U.S. CPI data and rate cut expectations. Consumer inflation data from April came in below expectations, fueling hopes for interest rate cuts by the Federal Reserve. The consumer price index rose by 0.3% in April down from 0.4% the previous months, signaling a cooling domestic demand. This data supported market speculations that the Fed might start cutting rates as early as November, enhancing the appeal of non-yielding assets like gold. The second factor is the mixed signals from the Federal Reserve. Federal Reserve officials have adopted a cautious stance, with some expressing satisfaction with the progress on inflation, while others remain vigilant. Federal Reserve Chairman Jerome Powell highlighted the mixed nature of the CPI data, but remained optimistic about achieving, achieving the 2% inflation target. Despite this, the market perceives a dovish tilt for the Fed, increasing the likelihood of rate cuts. For our weekly forecast, the outlook for gold remains bullish as traders anticipate continued support from central banks and favorable economic policies. The Fed's potential rate cuts, combined with robust stimulus measures from China, are likely to keep gold prices elevated. According to James Hirecheck, the technical analyst for FXOnline.com, bullish traders could run into resistance at the 2,432 level and 2,450 level, so be careful chasing the rally. With support around 2,354, Buying on dips is still the preferred strategy, with the potential for gold to test the 2,500 mark in the near future, given the current upside momentum. Let's call it there. 
Thank you for watching and remember time is your most valuable asset and I appreciate you sharing yours with me. Minuteman 6, signing off.